December 2009, was up at Killington for um, my first event of the season, Rails to Riches, and I felt a little tired after qualifiers, made it through to finals, took the first run, felt pretty good, wanted to start going for it, working some new tricks, and unfortunately came off that box a little too early to a flat landing, and boom. Sports that involve a lot of turning and twisting or planting and pivoting are the sports that um, people are at highest risk for getting an ACL tear. Women in particular, right after their growth spurt, get nice long legs but don't automatically get the muscle mass to support them. And that can be kind of a key window of vulnerability for getting an ACL tear. I got back home and we went to Children's to get the MRI, get the x-ray, make sure everything was intact and it wasn't. It was completely torn right through the middle. Julie is a tremendous athlete and with athletes of Julia's caliber, one thing we really have to focus on is making sure we can get them back to that level of activity. Dr. Murray did the best job fixing my ACL that anybody could do. The next morning was right off to physical therapy, getting right after it, and that to me felt like the start of the ACL's repaired, it's fixed, and now it's time to get back to where we were. And she definitely made that, that your ACL's repaired, but now it's, it's your turn to put the work in. When I first was told that Julia tore her ACL, I wasn't surprised. Slope style skiing is obviously a very unique sport with very unique demands on the body. Although a lot of it is placed on the knees, her total body is something we have to train strengthening wise. We're doing a lot of exercises that are not just the strengthening in the muscles surrounding the knee, but flexibility and range of motion in the ankle, in the hip. I think I've learned that you need to be patient and I needed to be trusting of Dr. Murray and of Eric working together. I needed to trust myself that I could get back to that high level of competition. A big part of slope style skiing is visioning things, and if you vision, you can do something. I am a firm believer that you can. Julia's story is a terrific one. She came back from a terrible injury, great adversity, and has overcome that, and now is skiing better than she ever has before. Julia is performing today at a really elite level. As much as we're challenging her body physically, we're challenging her body mentally. She's going to be able to do things, I think, without thinking twice about them. And I think that that's going to be very important to being able to score and get on the podium. To get to this high level and, you know, the Olympics this year, the biggest advice I can give is in your off season, take it seriously, be with the trainer, focus and work on total body strength and conditioning. I'm glad I trusted Dr. Murray because this is going to be the biggest season of my life.